Mm. Right now, today. I didn't even tell Stephanie this, but she gonna learn this on the edit. That's Tasha, that's Steph. Let's go ahead and fill in the rest. We gonna eat a little, prank a little. Our story time is the best. Have you LOL when you click play? No, this ain't no clickbait. Today, you guys, I'm doing some Chinese food. And um, before I get into the video, I want you guys to thumbs the video up, like, share, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. If you like the video, if you don't like it, then you don't have to do all that. And then um, I'm just gonna say, let's get into the video. Boom, I'm back. I'm gonna tell you guys what I have today. I have some homemade goiza or dumplings, whatever, you, the chicken and vegetable, two different kinds. They're not homemade, homemade. I made them at home, but they're frozen. Some chicken. This barbecue chicken from a Chinese place. This is some Chinese noodles. I don't know what they are. This is homemade fried rice. Again, I made it at home, but I used a seasoning packet, Kikoman. And this is bok choy, also from the restaurant. I have some meiploi Thai chili sauce. And yes, this is Chinese food, but I wanted some chai, Thai chili sauce. And this is uh, for the dumplings. So, oh, that's it. Okay. Oh, and some orange chicken. I forgot about you. Stephanie gave me chopsticks, so obviously that is all I'm using today. Let's see how this works out. I've never had food from this restaurant, but I've been wanting it. Mm -hmm. This tastes like that old school orange chicken. Look, this is not actually orange. That's good, though. It's not actually orange. It's like that color. Mm. It's good. Now that I try to fry rice. Mm, 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 mm. If you guys are new here, we usually have a little topic. I don't know if I have one today. I ain't gonna lie. I might read from the book. Hmm. Okay. That's good. I'm not sure if it's gonna be good. Mm, mm, mm. 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 Telling you. I taste wasabi. Now either they took this off of somebody else's plate and gave it to me, or they cook it in wasabi. They cook it in wasabi. Mmm. I hate wasabi, by the way. Mm. But they're okay. Let me try these noodles. Um, you guys, if you know what noodles these are, let me know. I don't know. It starts with an L. I'm gonna have such a hard time picking these noodles up. Let me see. Mm. They're good. Mm. Now, one of these um, dumplings I haven't tried. Um. It's this one. So I'm gonna try these for the first time. These I have tried and I love them. So I'm gonna try these. Mm. These are good. I think I like these other ones better. But these are really good. Mm, let me see if that mic is on. These are the dumplings I got, if you trust me, um, that are so bomb to me. They're from Daily Pride and it's chicken goza. They are so good. They're bomb. Mm. So anyway, like I was saying, I don't know if I'm going to have a topic. Because I don't have one right now. Mm. If y'all don't know what this is, it's bok choy. Chinese vegetable bomb. Mm. Except the wasabi, they playing. Mm. This orange chicken looks very suspicious, but it is really good. Mm -hmm. You guys, we have merch. 
it's so cute like some of the things that we, we design them or whatever from this website mm. some of the stuff is really cute only thing is from our, our YouTube like the links you can't see everything I don't even know if when you go into the store you can see everything but it's not um what was I going to say? I have no idea what I was going to say. Oh. They come in a lot of colors. I know somebody asked that today. Do they come in different colors? Yeah, we chose a lot of color options. Mm. Come on, man. Mm. Let me try this. I'll just show y'all the inside, but it ain't nothing really to see. It's bomb though. Today I'm eating Chinese food, like y'all know, but that's not what I was trying to say. I'm drinking Simply Lemonade Light. Whew! It tastes no different from regular lemonade, but it has a lot less calories. Not that any of this does, but. I'm going for cheat day, two days in a row. Mm, that wasn't yesterday that I cheated. That was when we did Five Guys. Mm. I don't even know Five Guys is out yet, but whatever. Who cares? We did Five Guys if y'all didn't see it yet. Coming soon. Or you already saw it. Mm. This little barbecue chicken thing is good. My goodness. This is so good. I don't know where to go next. Anyway, y'all. Y'all know I'm reading this book. The Gear of Living Consciously. Mm -mm -mm. I love it. This chicken look like horrible right kind of looks like mm. I don't know how it looks on camera but it's good though it looks nothing like it tastes this might just be an eating video because I'm still hungry I don't feel like picking up that book yet. I'll try to read and talk. I'm gonna read a little part to y'all. So it says, mm, 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 mm. I feel like a whole dog eating this. Just eating the bone. You have two great tasks in your life. To live in peace within yourself and to live in harmony with the people around you. I agree. If you don't find peace within yourself, nothing you do will feel satisfying. Nothing you accomplish You can surround yourself with material things, perfect children, perfect wife, but if you aren't happy with yourself, none of that gonna matter. And if you can't live in harmony with other people, what's the point? I'm not saying if you are living in harmony, go do something to yourself. Because sometimes you can't live in harmony with the people that are around you. Sometimes you gotta get rid of the ones you can't live in harmony with. You, you know personally, you that have, say for instance, you right here, you. The one that's over here in a bad relationship, arguing every day.
You can't even get your mind right at work because you're thinking about what's going to happen when you get home. You're anxious to go home and don't even want to go sometimes because you know your boyfriend or your girlfriend is going to start an argument with you for something. Or maybe everything she does irritates you and you normally don't feel like this. But in this relationship, you do. I'm not going to say it's her or him. Sometimes it's you. If you're not happy with yourself. Sometimes it's both of you. Or one of you. Figure out who it is so you can change it or roll out. Cause like I've told y'all before, there go another damn fingernail. I don't give a damn if it's a chicken wing. Look at this. That is a nail. Okay? Nail. Y'all can't tell me no different. A wing nail, whatever. It's a nail. I ain't eating it. I've been in a relationship where we fought all the time, we argued, and neither one of us really progressed. I won't blame her for the whole thing, even though I feel like it was 90% her fault. I feel like there are things I could have done to help, but whatever. I doubt it, because once we broke up, my wife got a hundred times better. Matter of fact, every time, because we broke up several times. So every time we broke up, my life got better. And then we would get back together because we broke up a few times. It seemed like everything would go downhill again. That's because somebody didn't want me with her. It was like, nah, that's not where you belong. If you ain't about to be happy, ain't no happiness here. You gotta let people go. Learn to let them go. Right now, today. I ain't even told Stephanie this, but she gonna learn this on the edit. Now, once in the blue moon, I'll do the person's taxes. I think last, I did them two years ago. So basically, anyway, what I was trying to say was, I'm over here happy, living my life with my new woman, wife. And just, you know, life has just gotten a hundred times better since I was with the last person. She asked me to borrow 60 bucks about two months ago. Text me in, asked me to borrow 60 bucks. Oh, hell no. <laughs> Stephanie probably inserted a oh hell no right there, not sure. But yeah, she did. Come on, she really needed it. Well. I really needed you to pay half the rent, a quarter of the rent, a penny of the rent. When we lived together too, didn't I? I need you to help pay for groceries. I needed you to watch my son when I was in school. When I was at work. Instead of me having somebody else watch him. We lived in the same house, just saying. So my point to that is y'all, that person you with, that you don't get along with, that you arguing with every day, whether it's his fault, her fault. You need to reevaluate that little thing because it keeps you from doing what you need to do in life. Arguing and fighting and turmoil keeps you from doing the positive things you need to do. You don't have a chance to think about what you want for your future because you're constantly thinking about arguing. Think about that. You're constantly thinking about, if your mind is constantly pressured with, how do I avoid arguing with her or him? How do I get, uh, you know, this? How do I stop? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I'll tell you how. End it. End it or make changes and make sure they're making changes. I ain't gonna lie, y'all can't eat no more. I don't like this whole goddamn thing. I feel like I'm gonna eat a whole horse. I ain't eating nothing, really. You know, I ate all these dumplings. They made me full. Anyway, y'all. I hope you like a little bit I had to say. I'm really hot. 
I'm trying to do some other stuff right now. I'm tired. I wish this video was longer. But I ain't gonna lie. I didn't even feel like doing one, but I was like, let me do a video. I was like, I'm gonna eat. So I might as well do a video. For those of you who don't care about talking too much and more so just like to watch people eat. For those of you who like Chinese food. For those of you who like to look at my forehead. For those of you who find me irritating, but you still come and watch. I understand, because I watch some people that I'm um, irritated by too. I don't know why. It's like, I don't know, it's a thing. Crazy, I guess, I'm crazy. Just like y'all. Um, anyway. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, give it a thumbs down. Tell me why you didn't like it. Maybe I can improve. Um, probably not. I'm just playing. I will improve if it's something that I feel like I need to. You know what I'm saying? Hit that notification bell, set it to all so you know when we post new videos, live streams, premieres. Sometimes YouTube will notify you and sometimes they won't. I mean, it is what it is. We have no control over that. I love y'all for real. I appreciate y'all. Y'all dope. We love y'all. Um, Thank God tax season is over for the most part. We still doing a tiny bit of taxes, but it's over for the most part. Thank the Lord we got through tax season. And until next time, only good vibes. Peace.